What's up guys, Matt here. I'm gonna just quickly show you the C to D chord slide. Something great, just kind of spice up some of your songs if you ever wanna throw it in there. Let's start out with a regular C chord. Second string, fourth string, fifth string. So first, second, third fret, second, fourth, and fifth. You play the bottom five, so. So all I'm doing, is drum the bottom five and slide up one, two. So now you're on the third, fourth, and fifth. So work on that transition. C, slide to D, to G. hammer on that four string with your middle finger and then go to a G and hammer on that fifth string if you want but work on that slide that C C hear that sound all you're doing keeping the same position sliding up two frets so you can do it strum and the strum again or you can make two sounds it's it's a little if you're a beginner you might have to strum each one. As you get more advanced, you can do that. And the other way, if you want to play the C like I do, which is a C add nine, like everybody tells me, you play just like your G, bottom two strings, third fret, and fifth and sixth, and just slide these two fingers down to the fourth and fifth. You can do the same thing. So instead of the second and third fret, you're sliding down to the fourth and fifth. So it's just an alternate way, instead of your regular D chord, of playing that. Just a quick little video to help spice up your playing the C to D slide. Check out countrysongteacher.com and tell somebody about the channel after you subscribe. I gotta get to work. I just thought I would shoot this one out there real fast. Look at this paperwork I gotta do. When you gotta scan this many documents and go through this, it's gonna be a long day. You gotta get you a Red Bull. They're not healthy for you, I know that, but sometimes I still get one. And you better get to work. God bless you.